The newly formed COVID-19 Vaccine Task Force, made up of state representatives, met for the first time today. Over a Zoom call, the lawmaker spoke to the previous director of the Rhode Island Department of Health, Dr. Michael Fine, as well as the dean of Brown School of Public Health, Dr. Ashish Jha. You did say that um, that all of the precautions have been taken in the de development of the vaccine and everything is safe and effective and that you will demonstrate that because you will roll up your sleeve first. Um, can you provide for this committee the data that you have used to draw that conclusion? 12 News reporter Sheena Loshudo spoke to Dr. Ja after the meeting and has the highlights. Sheena? Well, the meeting was basically a chance for the lawmakers to learn more straight from the experts. And a lot of the questions they had, you may be wondering the same thing. We want you to understand that we're going to make sure you get the vaccine and we want you to feel safe about it. The House COVID-19 Vaccine Task Force met virtually Wednesday, as it appears the nation is closer and closer to a vaccine. Local lawmakers all working to find answers, like who should get it first and how will that work? Plus, the overarching question, will Rhode Islanders feel like they can trust a COVID-19 vaccine? Why is it that we can have confidence in the fact that we did it, this has been done in 10 months, versus eight to 10 years. And I think um, it's a combination of luck, uh, really hard work, and a relatively easy virus to make vaccines out of. Dr. Michael Fine, the former Rhode Island Health Department Director, and Dr. Ashish Jha, the Dean of the Brown University School of Public Health, were there to address some of those common concerns. While the lawmakers made it clear, they will work to make sure the hardest hit communities here in Rhode Island won't get left behind. Talk about again to reiterate to the public um, about safety of the vaccine. And directly after the meeting, Dr. Jaw spoke with 12 News about what Rhode Islanders should really know. Can you talk about that? Because I think that's something that people would be interested in knowing more about. Yeah. So it is physically impossible to get COVID from any of the vaccines that are being tested right now. Certainly, the two vaccines that have finished their clinical trials, the Moderna and the Pfizer vaccines. They are not, they don't have any of the COVID uh, virus in it. Uh, you can't get COVID from it. And the task force says it plans to meet again next Wednesday. And this time they hope to hear from executives at Pfizer and CVS to talk about the distribution plan. In studio, I'm Sheena Loshudo, 12 News.